But we begin tonight with that breaking news. The dramatic rescue of a man and a dog right here stuck on a steep cliffside in San Pedro. Our Lauren Posen is live on the scene. And Lauren, you just got an exclusive one on one interview with that man. Well, Leslie and Ross, you know, as pet owners, uh, we all would do anything for our pets, even if that means getting stuck on this steep cliff here. And that's exactly what happened tonight. Uh, both are home safe tonight. They're OK. This cliff that this all happened on is right behind these houses here. And thanks to the swift action by firefighters, everyone got out OK. I want to show you some video moments after the rescue. Take a look. This is the video we got the moments after Zimba and his dad, Sean Kennedy, got back home here after firefighters rescued them both. Zimba is 13 years old. His owner, Sean Kennedy, told me that this all started around 7 o'clock when Zimba got out. He says he fell from a steep cliff behind his home here. This is video from SkyCal, and you can see just how steep of a hill it is. It's actually a 30-foot-plus drop down to the beach. That's what Zimba fell. Now, Kennedy says he didn't see Zimba, so he went to his car and went down to look for him below. And then he started to climb up to get, to get him, and that's when he got stuck, so he called 911. Within minutes, L.A. City firefighters, along with members of their urban search and rescue team, got here. And using a harness and rope to rescue, they both got him off the cliff. When I was uh, yelling his name out, he, I can hear him barking from down, from down the cliff. It's very steep. It's uh, slippery and wet from all the rain. The grass, it pulls out of the ground very easily, so you have no, uh, nothing to, no uh, support. And Kennedy tells me he's a little tired. He's still nervous and scared after what both he and his dog went through. Uh, Zimba, he looked happy as could be. He doesn't even, I don't think he realized anything really happened tonight. Um, he was just happy to be back home with his dad. Um, but Kennedy told me that he's really grateful for the uh, hard work of firefighters, uh, getting them both home safely tonight. Reporting live in San Pedro, Lauren Posen, KCAL News. Lauren, we've been following this for an hour and a half. We're so glad that everyone is okay. Thank you so much. Yeah. Also developing right now, a child is dead.